Welcome back. Uh, this is Fodia Solutions Academy. Fodia Solutions Academy. We really appreciate you all for your cooperation, for following us up. Uh, you can help us to do more. Please make sure you do more for us by sharing our videos across to your friends and also by what? Subscribe. Anytime you want to watch our video, you will see a subscribe button. Make sure you subscribe on it. Please help us to do that. We really appreciate you. This channel, you can learn any mathematics problem you're having. Make sure you can get it right. For anyone that has part, please make sure you start from part one. This should be the last part for this uh, first order differential equation, which is our exponential function. Exponential function. This should be the last part. Uh, before you watch this uh, episode, which is uh, me, this series, make sure you make, make sure you understand the um, differentiation and integration very well because so that there are a mixture of this particular one. And uh, if you are to watch any of our video, video, please make sure you start from part one, part one, part two, part three, and so on and so forth. Um, Thank you so much for your cooperation. I really appreciate it a lot. Now, in this video, I'll be walking through number one definition of definition of this method, which is exponential function. Uh, problem on them, on it. Problem on it. That is all about what I want to talk about on this video. Um, before I continue, if I'm talking about exponential, exponential is just like a of a raised to the power of what? This is called exponential function. Exponential function. Now, it's an exponential function. The condition is what? If, I mean, my condition is, it must be what? It may be an expression. If my x is greater than what? Uh, if it is greater than what? 1. If it is greater than 0. Sorry. If it is greater than 0. Now, if it is greater than zero, become a what exponential function. And with your ma machine, your calculation, I mean calculator machine, your calculator can provide uh, exponential function of it. But whenever you are having a problem that are attached to what e of x, they are known as what exponential function. They are known as exponential. Now, for instance, if you have a problem like um, okay, problem can come this way. Okay, that is all about. I can talk about on exponential. Now, if a problem is supposing, suppose, supposing we're having e of x y plus x minus y squared equals to what four, we are asked to find the y, the x. Now, this is a very good example of what exponential function. Now, how do I solve this particular problem? Solution to this problem. Now, if I want to solve this question. I must be very good when it comes to what exponential function. I must be very good on exponential. Now, what I will just do is that what I will have this. I will have this. This is called implicit function because of what there is mixture of what x and y at a point. There is mixture of what x and y at a particular point. It means how do I solve this one now? I can say that what d. Of what of x y all over what the x plus d of x all over the x uh, minus this one will not do what d of y squared all over what the x equals to what d of four all over the x. Now I'm just trying to approach my what the rules behind the, the uh, differentiation. Now since I'm having this, I will not say that what. My integral, I mean, if I should differentiate with the upper will come down on exponential. You know, I think you can watch our video on the differential calculus, which is exponential function is on it. Now, this will come down. I'll be having what? Um, I'll be having um d d of what the x bracket of what x y e raised to power what x y. Now I will close my bracket like this now plus this one will become one this one will become minus two of y dy all over the x equals to what 
um, this we should be um, I'll be having a zero I'll be having a zero there now that is all about that since I've differentiated that I'll be having sorry this is not the else okay now okay since I have this I will now move on to the next one how do I differentiate this particular issue that is where my problem lies this one how do I differentiate it I will differentiate it one by one I will hold one and it means exponential will be outside the bracket which is if I should hold one and differentiate one I'll be having what a bracket of what x dy dx um, and uh, plus this one will not be what if I differentiate my x I'll be having y bracket of sorry bracket of now since I have this I will answer that one plus minus one I mean plus one this my one is coming down okay and sorry for more space I need to be sorry this part plus one minus I will also do the same thing here I want to differentiate, I'll differentiate this one by what 2y dy all over x equals to zero now it means I'll be having two exponential e of what of x dy dx plus what y exponential xy plus one now if i should do it very well i'll be having okay plus one minus two y dy and dx equals to zero now take this two to the other side of the bridge it means i'll be having um i'll be having um 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 x e of y now dy dx minus 2y dy dx equals to this one will have a minus bracket of i'll be having one plus what e of x y bracket of now since i have this i cannot move on by having um i'll be having a bracket d or y okay let me just read this way standard way now i'll be having x e x y minus what 2y bracket of plus dy dx equals to minus 1 plus what e of xy or close now i cannot say that what i will divide both sides by it means my dy dx it will be equals to minus bracket of 1 plus e of y or close bracket divided by what s e of xy minus 2y Close bracket, which is it means my dy the x is equals to what is equals to that. That is my final answer. It means my dy the x is equals to that is what I'm having. Now by so I mean by doing this, I'm approaching towards what I'm working towards an exponential function. That is how to work it out. Now I can take this back to my OD, which is I will also reverse it back to where I'm coming from. That's all about exponential function, but don't forget that our exponential function is what e of, of x y into uh this is a what exponential function because of what e is an exponential raised to the power of what function of x and and y that is all about exponential function. This video will not be too much, it won't be too much. Just understand the concept behind OD. It means we have a full album of what OD. Once again, this is Further Solutions Academy. Okay, this is Further Solutions Academy. You can help us, encourage us more, help us to share our video and also subscribe. Make sure you view and what? You subscribe to our channel. Make sure you view and subscribe to our channel. Okay, um, Further Solutions, Further, sorry, this is your yeah, Further Solutions Academy. Encourage us more, help us to share and also subscribe 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 to this channel help us to share subscribe in this in our next uh, series we'll be working on second order of od second order of what ordinary differential equation which is going to be a part one part two and so on and so forth but that one once you understand this one you will understand the next one that's all about it 
other solutions academy please help us to drop your comments if there is any problem sure drop your comments if there is any problem we're going to attend to it and um if there is any need for a I mean, comment about our videos let us know on time so that we're going to be of help too thank you for watching